Are you ready for some football, ladies and gentlemen? I know I am. I am back. And right now on KTVGR, we're going to take a look at Legend Bowl, originally released in late November 2020 on Steam and released in August of 2023 on other modern platforms from developer Super Pixel Games. It's time to take a look and see how this game holds up. In the past, we all may have played arcade-style games based on American football. For instance, Tecmo Super Bowl, Super High Impact, NFL Blitz. But there is an audience where they have a preference of simulated sports games such as EA's Madden, which there hasn't been much of a competition from that arena since All Pro Football 2K8. Then there are some that blends in sports, simulation, and even humor in which that honor would go to Mutant Football League on modern consoles, along with its classic predecessor, Mutant League Football for the Sega Genesis. Run, run. Similar to the Madden simulation series of video games and arcade football games such as Blitz, you can select whatever play you want to use to execute each run or pass from offense and or defense and try to score touchdowns or other scoring aspects. Nothing terribly spectacular. So all in all, you have to choose your strategy well. It is also worth mentioning you can also create a franchise and customize how your team sees fit for a season. I will say one nitpick I have, albeit coming from personal experience, is the play control can be hit or miss. And no matter what difficulty you set it on, the AI can leave a lot to be desired. Even if you try to have CPU assistance making passes from the quarterback on your offensive team. What I like most about Legend Bowl is how the names of the teams have been changed to imaginary teams, such as the Green Bay Beavers and Indianapolis Racers. I think we can obviously understand that the NFL license cannot be used given EA has exclusive rights of it. However, the fictional teams are definitely a sight to be seen. But it is not like how the teams are parodied like how it is in Mutant Football League, but I digress. I also have to say that I am indeed a fan of the retro style graphics, but it does have a modern twist despite its simplicity. Overall, Legend Bowl is hit or miss. If you like simulation sports titles with a retro feel, go for it. However, for the asking price on the digital store outlets, no matter what platform you're getting it from, it can leave some heads scratching to see if consumers can find a better deal elsewhere. But that will wrap it up for this episode of Kid Thunder VG Reviews. I am Chuck Johnson, a.k.a. Kid Thunder. I am signing off. You guys take care. Keep playing your video games. Until next time. But there is an audience where they have a preference of simulated sports games such as EA's Madden. Which there hasn't been. How the f***? Similar to the Madden simulation series of video games and arcade football games such as Blitz, you can select whatever play you... Ah, uh, stupid Windows update. Dollar.